Today's adventure is going to take us to Olita State Park and Jonathan Dickinson State Park. Some trail maintenance. Zing. And he's got free passes, 10 spot, 12 we're spot. Trailblazers. Trailblazers. So, save a entry fee. Oh, yeah. Word is that there's some XE here, so I'm just going to go ahead and smash out these jumps real quick and check them out and then head on to the next park. We've got a big hip jump here. Pretty good size, enough where you are probably gonna wanna make sure you hip it. Takeoff is here, landing is here. This is much wider, and here's a big catch berm. So this will be the second jump is a big table. This one's super easy to clear. And then this one, it's like a qualifier, is a pretty good size step down that you have to float. And that is going to really set the par for the rest of the jumps. Here's your roller. And as you pump this roller, you are gonna go down to these jumps. Should be a good time. Let's see what we can do. Nice and smooth, and then the big hip jump. A steady spin is the real deal. I'm a stunt man, so you should know. Okay. The last one, boost, boost. Oh. Don't worry, you look great, man. I'm gonna let, let you savor in the moment, but I'm coming to you. Is How that, do you feel about that? How fucking awesome is that? <laughs> <laughs> so Brett, how do you feel about these jump lines? They scare me. Why do they scare you? They're big. How big are they? Big. Which one's the scariest one out of all, what is it? All three, which one's the scariest one? Uh, second one, because if you don't make the first one right, you're gonna hurt yourself. I think that's what we've learned from today. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, the second one is the scariest. Well, guys, that's going to wrap up Alita Park Jump Line. These guys put a lot of work in from last time I was here, and you can see a big difference here. There's a jump line's progressive. You have to have some skills to hit these jumps because what's really amazing is the first jump is a step down, and that step down is something that people, you know, really kind of veer away from, but that's the key to the entire jump line is nailing that first step down. Then you have a table. You can speed jump and skim speed, and the third one's a giant hip that you have to go to the far right side of the landing and turn the bike so you can hit the berm. We are going to meet up with my buddy Cameron at the Jonathan Dickinson Park, and they have just redone a free ride area there called the Bunker. Should be another great day on the trail. Check out some new stuff. Stay tuned for good time. So it looks like we uh, found our observation tower and we're gonna walk to the top and see what we can see. What do we have here? You brought some glass choices? A beginner, a beginner oh, okay. So, oh, okay, yeah. so you guys feel about that one? I don't know. Look at his shirt. It is crazy. Well, you guys got these color changing glasses. Like, look, Brett's got the orange ones on with the orange oh, shirt. Oh, here, let me put my blues on. And he's, she's got the blue ones with the blue shirt. It's kind of trippy when you, if you're on the trail and you take them off and you're in the jump section, it's like a brand new jump line when you switch colored glasses. I don't really recommend it for safety purposes, but if you want to have fun, you should totally do it. Kaleidoscope. So, still wait, waiting on Paul. Ain't nobody pedaling with Paul because Paul's not here. So, right, hey, Paul. Where's Paul? Huh? Where's Paul? <laughs> I got no traction. <laughs> so we are about to go check out the skills section of the park. We're gonna do some skinnies. Brett and Paul and Danica and Cameron.
So now we're walking around, checking out the pump track. Pump track's got a couple cool turns on it. Everybody's flowing. Oh, but ain't old Paul. Uh, and the pump track goes all the way around the outside of the skills area, which is a great thing. It really makes uh, the skills area center place and the outside for more speed. Good layout. Hey, how's it going, man? You look pretty chill over here. Yeah, just rocking the Ibis. It's pretty quick here. Looks like a lot of skimmer jumps, huh? Yeah, that's yeah. my son for you. That's my son? Well, how about you? Are you skimming these and enjoying these too? Oh yeah, Yeah. they're awesome. How do you feel about the ones on the left side? I was thinking about trying those. I think you're pretty good. I mean, you're, it's not like you're on a, a, a sissy bike or anything there, no, you know what I mean? I think you can. I'd like to see that happen today. Are we gonna see that happen today? Sure. Yeah, I'm just about to get a train in. You wanna to get towed in? Sure. All right, so we're gonna go and set up some cameras. It looks like uh, Paul, we just uh, center bod. Oh yeah, totally center, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Now, anybody that comes here has been a ride along and seen it happen, so you have no reason not to send it. You already got towed in. That's right, and I'm a big baby. If I sent it, you can send it. Mm. Oh, wrapping up the day, um, here at Jonathan Dickinson, got to ride a few jumps, some skills challenge stuff, and then we pulled that no footer. One more thing in the bag, um, as far as being more comfortable, definitely almost ate it. I just decided to do it in midair and almost missed the pedal. So, and then I tried it again and I did it. I just gotta perfect the timing. I feel like the no footer is so close to a Superman that it's like a mixed jump thing. It's awesome. Well, Paul, we pedaled. We did. We saw. We did. We jumped. Well, sort of. We no footered. Well, that's also sort of. I landed it. That count, but I don't get credit for that. You get credit for trying. No, no, I got feet off the pedals and back on. Well, yeah, the second time. The second time. It's, it counts then, still a trick in the bag. It's a, well, you know, first try. So you're saying that it wasn't clean enough to call it that I can do it? Well, no, it was good to, it, was, it's only like really progression if you do it on the first try. <laughs> <laughs> I like it though, I like it, I like it. We was sitting it and jumping, it was great. So uh, make sure you guys check out this guy's channel. I'll leave it in the description below and on the ending screen. Should I wanna see you guys out there hitting this park if this is your local park. If you're from out of town or not, you've been on it, you can send it, you can do it. We'll see you on the next adventure. We're walking over, Logan's about to hit it. Never done another one footer. How many times have you done a no footer? Never, not on purpose. So we're about to send him over the biggest jump at this park to do a no footer and see what happens. Yo, yo, yo.